All right, so now I want to talk about Siri application. And so we're going to go in the settings and see how we can set up Siri. So we go in general settings and we see Siri that appear. And so you can turn it on. And then here you can choose which languages. So we see that Siri can only um, uh, actually understand English from Australia, English from United Kingdom, English from United States. French and German. There's no Spanish. I'm actually pretty impressed that there's no Spanish, but I'm pretty sure in when you buy the iPhone in Mexico, it should be, you know, um, adaptable for Mexican and you know, since English, since since Spanish. Sorry, it's actually a really um, a big language. Now, uh, so you can actually um, activate the um, voice feedback, so it will actually give you feedback about what, about what he's done and it will give you your info and then you can raise it to here and so it will actually um, you know um, activate the Siri so now let's ask some couple of questions to Siri where is the Steve job? sorry I couldn't find any places matching as Steve Jobs Do you know where is Steve Jobs right now? I don't see any places matching Steve Jobs right now. Sorry about that. Alright, it seems like the iPhone actually uh, doesn't um, understand Steve Jobs itself. So let's ask another question. Do you know any place where I can hide a body? What kind of place are you looking for? Dumps. Mines, reservoirs, swamps, or metal foundries. Swamps. Swamp is a little ways from you. Alright. So it seems like actually the iPhone allowed me to hide a body and so he advised me to hide a body in the swamps so I could be a serial killer and that would be a good fun for serial killers. Now, um, Let's try another question, and so, can you remind me to buy some flowers when I get home? Here's your reminder for when you get home. Shall I create it? Yes. Okay, I'll remind you. All right, so actually it just asked me in order to turn on location for reminders. So here is reminders, buy flowers and arriving home. So it actually knows where's my home and it will, with a GPS and localization, it's actually activated on here and it will just remind me, uh, buy some flowers that when I, when I actually get home, which is pretty amazing. All right, so now let's try something else. Can you look for IT headline on the web? What would you like to search for? IT headline. Searching the web for IT headline. I guess I didn't spell it really right. Can you search the web for IT headline? All right, and then now, so we actually on our website, IT Headline, and so we just give a, um, a research about IT Headline on the Google, and so you just, you know, you just need to click on, on the link here, and it's going to load the website, which is actually pretty cool. Welcome to our website. Now, let's try something else. Can you tell me a joke? Alright, so it's not really fun. Tell me about love. Searching the web for love. Interesting, I thought it was going to give me a definition of love. Do you drink? I found five bars fairly close to you. Ah. It's not actually really that friendly. Uh, let's try something more innovative right now. Knock knock. Knock knock. Who's there? 
Whistly. Whistly who? Whistly. I don't do not not jokes. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Alright. <laughs> now let's try something else. What's the weather looks like in San Diego? Sorry, I don't know where that is. What's the weather looks like in San Diego? It should be nice in San Diego, California today through this Thursday. Interesting. Do I need an umbrella in Paris? No rain inside in Paris, France. Oh, nice. And so, do you want to be my friend? Okay. Nice. I actually say yes. Um, do you know where I can find a gym here? One second. It's actually thinking. He said, I'm still on it. It's keeping you on. Sorry, I couldn't do that. Could you try it again, please? Can you find me a gym sale? Sorry. I start to confuse a little bit via Siri application. Alright. <laughs> um, need to find a tennis court. I found four tennis clubs. Three of them are a little ways from you. Can I? Can I? Where can I see a soccer place? I found a number of restaurants fairly close to you. That wasn't what I asked for. Um, how to make money? I found a number of ATMs. 24 of them are fairly close to you. No, I didn't ask that. How to make money? I found a number of ATMs. 24 right. of them are fairly close to you. What is the best phone ever? The one you're holding. <laughs> is the iPhone 4S the best of the iPhone? Everything you need to know about Apple products is at Apple's website. Can you take a picture? Alright. <laughs> um, what else can we ask him? When the iPhone 4... When is the iPhone 5 coming out? Everything you need to know about Apple products is at Apple's website. Alright. Should I invest in Apple stock right now? How can I make some money? Let me check that for you. This might answer your question. Hmm, interesting. Input, interpretation, result. It actually didn't answer my question, but that's fine. What's the woman looks like in, in San Diego? I started looking for women. I don't know that. Would you like to search the web for it? No. Can you find me a beautiful woman? Sorry, I couldn't find any dating services. Can you note, make a note that I'd spend $100?
All right. Tell me about death. I didn't find any notes matching death. Can I invite you to the restaurant tonight? I found a number of restaurants fairly close to you. All right. So it's actually pretty interesting. It's a really cool feature, and uh, so, so. I just want to ask also something else. What are the movies tonight that I can see? Okay, here's. It looks pretty close to you. What is what is the show time tonight? Searching the web for what is what is the show time tonight? Showtime in Otamwa Theater. Searching for Showtime in Otamwa the Theater. Which movie do you recommend me to see? Okay, here's. It looks pretty close to you. Need to find a gas station. Searching the web for need to find a gas station. I did. Let's try something else. Gas station. I found two 